Hey everybody, Dear Real here. Oh, I should have mentioned this on my birthday post, but oh well, it's probably better that it goes in this video anyway. A while ago, the release date for a Bad Apple Wars changed to October 13th, and there is a special Day 1 edition that you can get only at GameStop. I'll put a link in the description below for the uh, product page for that. And secondly, and for me most importantly, during Otomate's Otomate Party announcement of gorgeous upcoming Japanese titles, they finally announced the CollarX Malice fan disc, CollarX Malice Unlimited. Of course, I have no idea when they may decide whether or not it's going to get an English localization, but let's keep our fingers crossed. A link to Idea Factory's opening video of the game. There's definitely a particular extra that they're hinting at that I really want to see. Lastly, don't forget that Fashioning Little Miss Lonesome comes out this Friday on the 8th. The All Ages version on Steam and the 18 Plus version on Manga Gamer. That's it for news. You can go now if you don't want to hear me whine. <laughs> Of course, I'm sorry for the spamming of videos lately for those of you who mind it, but, you know, there's a significant reason. Of course, the people who mind probably wouldn't actually listen to this video anyway. My regulars know that I never shied away from talking about my mental illness because I feel that it can help others to know that someone else is experiencing something similar and that they aren't alone, that they aren't just some weirdo or something. Some people seem to think you shouldn't talk about such things, sometimes because I guess they think it should be taboo, but when you put yourself out there like this, you also open yourself up to attacks from trolls. I guess some people are worried that that's hard for a lot of people, you know, putting yourself out there and uh, worrying about cyberbullying or whatever. But fortunately, at my age, trolls don't bother me because I've had enough experience that I know how meaningless they are and how worthless their comments are. Right about now, I feel the need to kind of share because I'm getting so afraid about the edges and I'm, as I'm in my final stretch. And it's like a race between my next mental breakdown and finishing Cholerix Malice. So it's like I'm hanging on to the edge for dear life to finish this. I mentioned before that I'm working so hard to finish the game because of that. And I can't keep doing this for a few more weeks because I'm getting so close to the edge. And some people might just say, let it go. But remember, part of my problem is obsessiveness. So... Leaving the project unfinished will just tear me apart from the inside of my heart and my head for weeks to come if I don't finish it. So every two or three nights I've been staying up all night to work on videos. It's not too bad and helps me to get double the work done for the nights that I do it. I'd like to go into more details about the psychology of what I've been doing lately, because that was all kind of loose and probably sounds kind of meaningless without details, but I don't have the time at the moment. Today's the day that I'm supposed to do some family stuff, Though I'm going to be thinking about the breaking videos the whole time, of course. Sorry if there's a lot of background noise in this video from the family walking around upstairs. So, I gotta get ready for a company now, and I'll be back on videos ASAP. Talk to you again in a few days with more details about this stuff. Thank you all so much for understanding and the love. I've been feeling quite a lot of love in here, particularly lately, and I really appreciate everybody who's been so supportive and helpful with all this. And all the people who've been awing over the color smell stuff with me, because I'm really loving this game, and... Yeah, it's really exactly as I thought, like, that it would be my second favorite Otsume game, just under Code Realize. It's giving me all kinds of feels. Alright, well, hope to see you all soon. For now, Dirilly signing out. Bye-bye, everybody.